In Los Angeles, on this day, which should represent peace and tranquility, it was in fact a day filled with tension in many communities because of the current wave of gang warfare. Ryan Rooney reports. It was a peaceful morning as sunrise services were celebrated in the Hollywood Bowl. But this Easter weekend has brought some of the worst gang violence in Los Angeles history. Friday night, a drive-by shooting left one man dead and 12 others wounded, including a four-year-old girl. If we were angry before, we are exceedingly angry now. The killers were not caught. Saturday night, a task force of 360 officers hit the streets, nervously approaching suspicious vehicles with weapons drawn and rounding up young men believed to be members of street gangs. And we want to get the message out to the little cowards out there, cowards who shoot down four-year-old kids. And that's what they are, rotten little cowards. We want the message to go out that we're going to come and get them. Residents here feel trapped in their neighborhoods. I feel like a prisoner on the streets. I mean, I feel like I got to watch my back or beware of somebody trying to take, take my money or pull a gun on me or something. This city has vowed to stop gang violence. But as police hunt the people responsible, they must follow a trail of bodies. Brian Rooney, ABC News, Los Angeles.